Bring that heart really to God. Maar de volgende vraag die ik stel is van heb je dan werkelijk dat hart aan God gegeven? Because if that heart is not for God. Want als jouw hart niet van God, niet naar God gegeven is. Then it has no worth. Dan heeft het geen waarde. The heart has to belong to God. Jouw hart die moet God toebehoren. You must invest in getting closer to God. Je moet investeren in het uh, dichter bij God te naderen. God's plan for your life will not work except you are really investing in the things of God in your heart. Gods plan voor jouw leven die zal niet werken tenzij je dan werkelijk investeert in de groei in die dingen van God. Faith is in your heart. Geloof is in je hart. Your faith is in your heart. Je geloof zit in je hart. I have seen, you know, do you know there are, I've seen people who can quote the Bible and everything, but God is not in their heart. Ik heb dan mensen ontmoet die dan de Bijbelgeschriften kunnen citeren, maar God is niet in hun hart. I've seen people come to church. Ik heb mensen naar de kerk zien komen. God is not in their heart. Maar God is niet in hun hart. We must love God more than what he gives to us. We moeten God lief hebben boven de dingen die hij aan ons heeft. Must. We moeten dat doen. If you do not love God more than what he has given to you, your heart does not belong to God. Als je dan niet in staat bent om God lief te hebben boven de dingen die hij aan jou gegeven heeft, dan heb je je hart nog niet aan hem gegeven. Pastor, what do you mean? Pastor, wat bedoel je daarmee? What did you pray that God should give you? Remember our first Bible verse says, uh, 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 Mark 11:24 24, if you pray, you believe, I'll give it to you. But if you really prayed for something, God gave it to you. How do you use that thing he gave to you? Als je dan werkelijk hebt gebeden en God die heeft het aan jou gegeven, hoe, ge hoe gebruik je datgene wat God aan jou gegeven heeft? Let me use one thing. Laten we daar één voorbeeld geven. Driver's license. Je um, rijbewijs. Oh Lord, give me driver's license. En dan heb je gebeden, oh Heer, geef me dan mijn rijbewijs. Lord, give me driver's license. Oh Heer, geef me dan mijn rijbewijs. Josephine has one. Jo Josephine heeft één. She doesn't even go to church. En dan gaat ze niet eens naar de kerk. I know Adam. En Adam. He hates you. En hij haat u. But he has driver's license. Maar hij heeft ook een rijbewijs. Father, give me driver's license. Vader, geef mij een rijbewijs. Oh Lord. Oh Heer. If I have Apple 7 as telephone, I will worship you. Als ik dan give een uh, Apple telefoon heb, dan zal ik u aanbidden. Lord, I worship you. Heer, en dan zal ik u aanbidden. Oh Lord. Oh Heer. Oh Lord. Oh Heer. If I pass my exam. Als ik mijn uh, als ik sla voor mijn examen. I will sleep in the church. Dan zal ik dan in de kerk slapen. And I will serve you. Is that not how we pray? Is that Come on, talk to me. Is that not how we pray? Is that we ask him different things. We vragen hem verschillende dingen. And he's a giver. En hij is een gever. He knows your heart, but he still gives to you. Hij kent jouw hart, maar hij geeft nog steeds. And aan after you. giving you the thing. En nadat hij dan dat uh, dat gegeven heeft. You don't remember him. Dan herinner je hem. Niet. That thing becomes an obstacle to serving God. Dan wordt dat een obstakel in de weg om hem te dienen. Lord, give me job. Oh Heer. I need baan. job. Ik heb een baan nodig. God gives you a good job. En ge God geeft jou een goede baan. And they say, who's going to work on Sunday? En dan vragen ze wie kan dan op zondag werken. He said, put my name on Sunday permanently. <laughs> permanently. 250%. Put my name permanently. 240%. Any day I don't want, I will tell you myself, but put it permanent. Zet het maar, zet me altijd op zondag. Say, pastor, it's easy for you to talk. I, I, I work also. The first thing I told my manager, I don't work on Sunday. Eerste wat ik dan aan Say, why? Be gezet, you're so okay, because you're a pastor. No, before I became a pastor. Voordat ik een pastor was. I don't work on Sunday. Ik werk niet op zondag. The issue went to the director. They called me. I said, I don't work on Sunday. I'm a Christian. En I don't de, work on Sunday. De zaak die kwam, die ging dan helemaal naar de directeur. En daar heb ik ook gezegd, ik ben een christen. Dus ik werk niet Saturday op zondag. Saturday I can give you by Sunday. Forget it. I won't Zaterdag give it kan ik werken, maar zondag. And up to today. En tot de dag van vandaag. I won't do it. Zal ik het niet doen. It's a principle. Het is een principe. Okay, let's leave Sunday. 
Okay, laten we dat. Uh... I read some of the messages all of you are sending. Some people say, "Oh, I cannot come because I'm working on this day." Oh, I cannot come because I'm working on this day. If everybody is working on this day, who will do the work of God? Als iedereen op die dag werkt, wie kan dan het werk van God doen? The way it is done now is this. Let me tell you. You want to hear the truth? The way it is done now is this. If I am not doing anything, then I serve God. Als ik dan niks aan dus doe, that's what I see. If there is nothing I'm doing, als er niks anders is dat ik dan moet doen, then I serve God. Dan dien ik God. If I'm walking or I have a little headache or my eye is a little bit turned to the left or my child has more catar or there is a little supermarket close to my house, I cannot come. I will come when everything. Als er no. Is, dan kan ik niet. Who gave you life? Wie heeft jou Who gave you life? Wie heeft jouw leven gegeven? To serve him, not for another thing. Om te dienen, niet voor iets anders. Some people are working because their job cannot do anything. I understand. Those people have spoken to me. I know. Die kunnen er niks aan doen. It's just the way their work is. I don't have problem with those ones working on Sunday. But I'm talking of those whose jobs are not like that. Maar ik heb het nu over de mensen waarvan hun werk niet op die manier gebouwd is. Those hunting for 250 percent. Degenen die op zoek zijn naar die 240 procent. There are some people their job you can do nothing. That's how it is arranged. There's nothing you can do. It's arranged like that. Zo is het dan heel. Zo zit het in. I don't have problem with that. Daar heb ik geen probleem. I know those people. But I'm talking of those who are gathering money so that they can go on holidays. Maar ik heb het over de mensen. Anything, any. Oh, you are not coming us. I will work for you. Oh, oh, I'll work for you. Oh, jij kan niet op een Ik zou voor jou. Oh, yeah, I'll work. I'll work for you. Ja, ik zou dan. Yeah, 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 yeah. Take everybody's home. En dan nemen ze al die diensten zodat ze geld bij elkaar kunnen verzamelen voor de vakantie. After all the money. En na al dat geld. What next? Wat is het volgende? It's not, it's not that God has not provided enough for you. It is not that God has not enough for you. Have foreseen. But you want to wear the latest clothes so that you will be better than every other person, and then you can go to hundred vacations, and then we'll clap for you. No. But it is not that you have the most beautiful clothes, and then we will clap for you. The Bible says, God says, if I can provide for the beds. God is saying, for us, I'm providing. He says, how about you who look like me? Somebody say amen. amen. Everything we have is enough. Alles wat we hebben. The only no. problem is we want what we cannot afford. Maar het probleem is dat we dan meer meer willen dan we kunnen verdragen. Somebody say here. Yeah. Somebody say here. Ik luister. Let me tell you one thing. Laat me jou één ding zeggen. Anything. Alles. That is before God. Die je dan voor God zet. Is your God. Dat is jouw God. Say I give God my heart. No, you have your heart by yourself. You didn't give Him. You say for oh, I can't. My heart is not with God. No, that is your heart is not by God. You say you give God your. You didn't give Him anything. You have done next. The heart is with you. You are just lying that the heart is with God. You lift. Because when we check with God, it's not with Him. Since God gave you the driver's license, how many Christians have you carried in that your car? Since God, you are still carrying those who smoke in the car. Who feel Christian and happy down in your car? When they are smoking, say you don't smoke in my car. Make Christian say keep quiet. And that is how far. Drive on. I will stop and push you out. Call police to arrest you. It's my car. I'm driving it because the Lord gave it to you. And the Lord gave it to you. We can mention many things. We can mention many things. We can mention many things. We live God and we worship God. God has given to us. We we let God and we go then that thing that God has given us. There is nothing we have today that God did not give us. There is nothing that we have today that God has not given us. There is nothing that we have today that God Can I tell you one thing? Can I tell you one thing? Anything you do not surrender to God is not secure. Alles wat je dan niet aan God onderwerpt, dat is niet verzekerd. Can I say it one more time? 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 Anything you do not surrender to God and give to Him, that thing is not what secured. Alles wat je dan niet aan God hebt onderworpen. That thing is not forsaken. Satan went to uh, Satan went to God and said, "Can I try Job?" Satan he went then to God and he said, "Can I try Job?" Job then misled him. Can I try him? What did God tell him? God said, "Touch everything." God he said, "You can touch everything." But don't touch his heart. But you can't touch his heart. Why? Warum? Because Job's heart is with God. Because Job's heart was by God. If you want to tell somebody is a Christian, touch what he likes. If you want to try to tell someone that he is a Christian, 
Raak datgene aan wat die persoon Some people heeft. are very nice Christians until you talk about tight. Oh. Sommige mensen die zijn hele goede oh. christenen totdat je het over de ah, hebt. Touch not my money. Raak niet mijn geld. They will quote the whole Bible for you. Ze zullen dan alle bijbelteksten citeren. The money is their god. Maar de, uh, het geld is hun god. Some of them is job. Sommige van hun dan Some is their house. Of hun huis. Oh my god, their house. Hun huis. Their house. Hun huis. Some of them is their children. Of hun kinderen. I do alles for my kind. Ik doe alles. Ik I do everything for my children. How about God? Do you do alles for your God? And do you that ook everything for your God? Oh, some of you didn't come for this today, did you? Sommige van jullie die zijn niet. And they say with pride. I can die for my children. Can you die for God? Dan, oh, the children are not kinderen. yours in the first place. The children are God's own. Die kinderen, die zijn niet eens Amen. Die zijn dan If that child is having a headache, can you protect the headache? Als de, uh, dat kind uh, hoofdpijn heeft, kun je daarvoor uh, kun je het uh, beschermen daarvoor? When I read messages of people, Als ik dan boodschappen van mensen lees, I can know where your heart is. Dan kan ik, dan weet ik waar jouw hart ligt. Is God number one? Staat God op nummer 1. Say seek first the kingdom of God. Ja, zoek eerst het koninkrijk van God. And all these other things people are running around will be added en to you. Alles wat mensen dan achterna gaan, die zal aan jou toegevoegd worden. Does it mean you should not work hard? Betekent dat dat je dan niet hard hoeft te werken? No, you should work hard. Natuurlijk, je moet hard werken. I was talking to my son today. I said there is dignity in labor. Ik heb vandaag tot mijn zoon. Somebody said there is dignity in labor. Er is waardigheid in het werken. We are going, I'm going through some experience with my dear son. Very tough experience. Vele Very tough. Met mijn zoon. I told my wife, stay away from me. This is man to man. And I kept telling my wife, stay away. No emotion. Stay away. Buiten. Man to man. It is man tot man. Geen there emotion. are things women can handle. And, and there are things, the hardness and toughness and the roughness and the audacity of a man is needed. Er zijn dingen die dan vrouwen kunnen doen, maar er zijn You'll be crying die inside, but you'll not be seen here. Dingen die dan echt voor de man. Mm. Why? Because Vraag. you are breaking a rock, so that you can change the shape. Breken, zodat je Forever. Dan voor altijd kunt veranderen. I told him there is dignity in what labor. Ik heb hem verteld er is waardigheid in het hard werken. There is no work that is under anybody who wants to become a human being alive. Can I say one more time? There is no job is that is under you die dan onder jou, that you onder cannot do die je dan niet kan doen if you want to be a human being alive. Als je dan een persoon wil zijn. When I went to where, work where I was working, after the interview, the man said, I can't hire you. I said, why? Say you are too qualified. Say you are the one saying it. I'm ready to do anything. Mm. Ah, the man, I say anything. Other picking anything, I will sweep the ground. Ik heb dan gezegd van maak mij niet uit. Ik ik ben in staat om alles te doen. He took me like that. En hij heeft me dan zo aangepakt. With very low salary, I started. Met een, een When een I sweep salary. the ground, I sweep it with excellence. Als Somebody dan, say with excellence. Als ik dan de vloer zwel, dan doe ik dat in uitmuntendheid. When I pick orders, I pick it as the way we arrange it. You will know that this man knows what he's doing. Ophaal, Amen. Not up to two weeks, they took me to another place. And then om de twee weken dan namen ze mij naar een andere. And they take me here. And then ging ik weer Until naar finally I landed in the office. Totdat ik dan in de kantoor verlaat. Where I'm qualified for. Waar ik dan. If I was looking for that one, I will still be walking around it tomorrow. Als ik dat had uh, vanaf het begin had uh, nagestreefd, dan zou ik dan so, tot vandaag. There is lopen. nothing any man can do that is under him. Dus er bestaat geen. It depends on how good you are doing it. Het is Somebody say amen. Yeah, Somebody say yeah, I can't do that. You can't do what? A young child? You are not serious. You can do it. Serious. You can do it. If you have to clean the street, clean it. Als je dan de straat is walk. It. It is work. There are people doing it. Er zijn mensen die het doen. Amen. Amen. <laughs> My first paid job. Mijn uh, eerste betaald, betaalde baan. In fact, I had two that time. Ik had twee in die tijd. I was telling my son. I wanted to do business, so I bought bread one naira. You know, one naira bread. Ten. Ik wilde ten. Let me know if you ten pieces. Eh? Doen, then they will add two. It's twelve. The, the other twenty cowboys you gain, right? Okay? 
I want to do business, so I went to buy from my father's bakery. Dus I want to do business, not your own. Give me my own. Dus you know, young ik children like to have their own, right? So we hun eigen Give me my own. Geef me eigen. I carry the thing around the whole market. En ik heb dan gedragen hele markt. From 9 o'clock to 5 in the evening. Van 9 tot 5 uur in de middag. I thought because they know my father they will buy from me. En Nobody ik dacht omdat ze mijn vader kennen dat ze van, bij mij ook zouden komen kopen. I didn't sell one loaf. Maar ik heb daar geen één brood gekocht. When I came home, I was exhausted. En ik was helemaal uitgeput. And my father told me how fast. Yeah, he didn't buy. <laughs> God bless mothers. My mother bought one. <laughs> Mijn moeder, when I was already at home. Toen ik dan thuis, thuis aankwam. Already at what? Home. Not in the market. After the lesson, how do I sell it now? I don't have shop. En ik heb daar geen winkel, dus hoe And I have to go to school. En ik moest naar school. How do I sell my bread? Hoe verkoop ik dan mijn eigen bread? That's how children think. Zo denken kinderen. So I learned a lesson quick. Dus ik heb dan heel As snel The second job was to fill the drum. You know drum. How many of you know drum? Om to feed mijn drum with water from river. Vullen, when the drum is full, vullen. you get ten kobo. I en thought it's, a, it's only when you go two times it will be full. <laughs> Ik dacht dat je dan met twee keer lopen dan vol uh, zat. With my small, how old was I? Around twelve. What ca can I carry those big buckets? No, it's the small one. Kan I, can carry. Dan die grote vaten I went the first one. The one that poured on the ground is more than the one that poured inside the drum. <laughs> And the river is very far. And the river is very far. I went the second one, I came. And then the second time when I came. By six o'clock. It was then six hours. I was not yet half. And I sat on the other half. The woman says, "Stop, stop, 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 stop." And the woman said, "Let it go." Oga Peking, go. I will see your father. I will then go to your father. I received the money, but I was never allowed to do it again. I kept them well at geld ontvangen, maar ik was niet in staat om het werk opnieuw te doen. But I learned one thing. Maar ik heb daar één ding geleerd. Money does not come easy. Geld die komt dan niet makkelijk. Every money you earn, you work for it. Elk geld wat je dan hebt, moet je voor werken. And that's why I have a lot of value for money. En daarom waardeer ik het geld. Most children don't have value for money. Vele kinderen hebben geen waarde. Because they have geld. never worked. One Omdat day. ze nooit voor gewerkt hebben. We protect them too much. We beschermen hun te veel. Even at home we don't let them do anything. Zelfs thuis dan laten we hun niks doen. You don't love that child, you're killing the child. Dan heb je dat kind niet lief. Amen. Is your heart with God? Is your heart with God? That's the question. That is the vraag. Lift up your hands and say, Father. I repent, I repent for giving you my heart, you my heart and, taking it back, and taking it back and thinking that you have it. I made a mistake. Forgive me. I give you my heart now. Voluntarily. Obediently. Consciously. Not forced by anybody. But being aware of the consequences and the benefits, Lord, accept my heart so that you can protect everything that I have, so that you can give me more. Father, forgive me for worshiping the things you gave to me. Instead of worshiping you. For placing value in what you gave to me. More than you who gave it to me. Father, from now on, I will not worship any idol. I will invest my life in worshiping you. I will invest more in my heart. From your, word, from your word, so that I will be rich, so will be rich in, you, in you from now on. From now on. In, Jesus name. in Jesus' name. Somebody say amen. amen. This is the greatest prayer you can pray. That is dan het grootste gebed wat je dan ooit kunt What doen. some of us experience is actually God just taking his hands away a little bit to prove to you that he is the one who actually sustains you. 
Wat wij dan aan het ervaren zijn, is dat God een beetje zijn hand van jou heeft afgenomen om jou te laten voelen hoe het voelt. Sometimes he will just take his hands away. Soms dan haalt just hij dan heel even een klein beetje zijn hand weg. So that you will know that he's the one doing it, not you. Zodat je dan zult weten dat hij degene is die het doet en niet jij. We pray right now. We bidden op dit moment. That whatever was taken away from you will be restored tonight in the name of Jesus. Amen. Amen. I say your health will be restored in the name of Jesus. Amen. Amen. Your finances shall be restored in the name of Jesus. Amen. Your family will be restored in the name of Jesus. Amen. If you have a duty in the church, Als je dan een taak hebt in de kerk, it's a privilege het is een voorrecht to be blessed. Om gezegend te worden. Don't let anybody remind you. Laat niemand jou herinneren. Don't let anybody push you. Laat niemand jou duwen. Because if the person does it, want als die persoon het doet, you don't have the blessing anymore. Dan heb jij de zegen niet meer. Because your heart is not there. Want je hart die is er You niet should daar. be pursuing God with zeal. Jij moet dan God achtervolgen met ijverigheid. Proverbs chapter 25. Spreuken hoofdstuk 4. God's plan is bigger than your past. Gods plan is groter dan je geschiedenis, je verleden. Proverbs 25, vers 4 tot 5. Vers 4 en 5. Take away the wicked from the throne, from the presence of the king, and the throne shall be what? Established. The throne shall be what? Established. The first one it says, remove the impurities from the silver, and you will get the purity of the silver. Amen. Amen. Remove the impurity from gold that you will know that gold has value. And he said, remove the wicked. Take away the wicked from before the king and his throne shall be established in righteousness. Amen. Lift up your right hand and say, Father, Father fight against the enemies of my enemy. Fight against the enemies of my enemies. Every enemy, Every enemy pursuing me. Today is your end. Today's your end. Take away the wicked from the king and he will prosper. Take away the, the wicked from the king. Name the slechte van the koning. The, the kind of people around the king determines what happens in the kingdom. The, the sort mensen om, uh, rondom de koning die bepalen wat er dan gebeurt in het koning. I want to teach you a little bit of leadership right now. Ik Those of you who are in the leadership team, pay very good attention. Pay good attention. Heel, uh, aandacht schenken. The kind of people that are around the king will determine how the kingdom functions. De soort mensen om de koning die bepalen hoe dan het koninkrijk functioneert. The kind of people that are around you will determine the kind of life you have. De soort mensen om je heen die bepalen wat voor soort leven jij hebt. If you are going around with thieves, you will soon be a thief. Als je dan met uh, dieven om je, uh, um, omgaat, dan zul je dan binnenkort ook een dief. If you are moving around with liars, you will soon begin to practice how to lie. Als je dan om je heen uh, leugenaars hebt, dan zul je dat ook gaan praktiseren. If you are walking around with gossipers, you will soon be a better gossiper than them. Als je dan met roddelaars omgaat, dan zul je binnenkort dan zelfs een betere roddelaar zijn. The people that are around the king determines what happens in the kingdom. De mensen om de koning heen die bepalen wat er gebeurt in het koninkrijk. That includes your partners. Dat betekent dat zijn dan jouw partners. At home. Thuis. Your friends. Jouw vrienden. And the people you have around you. En de mensen om je heen. They have great influence on you. Ze hebben heel veel invloed op jou. Without you knowing. Zonder dat je het weet. In the church. In the kerk. In the kingdom of God. In het koninkrijk van God. Those around the king influences the action of the king. Degene om de koning die be die beïnvloeden de acties van de koning. Is not by advice. Het is dan niet door advies. By what they do. Maar door datgene wat ze doen. The king carries the vision. De koning die draagt dan de visie. He gives the vision to people around him. En die die, die draagt het over aan de mensen. Om And if hem. those people cannot carry it out well. Maar als die mensen het niet goed kunnen uitdragen. It will affect the people in the kingdom. Dan zal het dan invloed hebben op de mensen in het koninkrijk. Take away the wicked from 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 before the king so that the king can have a good time. Doe de goddeloze van de koning weg, zodat de koning een goede tijd zal hebben. Those around you are very important. 
Degenen om jou heen die zijn heel belangrijk. Those around the king are very important. Degenen om uh, rondom de koning zijn heel belangrijk. They do the following things. Ze doen de volgende dingen. Number one. Nummer één. They protect the king's image. Ze beschermen imago van de koning. The image of the king is what determines how important the kingdom is. Het imago van de koning bepaalt hoe belangrijk het koninkrijk is. We are in a kingdom. We zijn in een koninkrijk. We are not in a democracy. We zijn niet in een democratie. In a kingdom. In een koninkrijk. The image of the king is very important. Het imago van de koning is zeer belangrijk. Not the image of the members of the kingdom. Niet het imago van de leden. The image of the king. Maar het imago van de koning. If the king is having a bad name, als the kingdom will suffer. Als de koning een slechte naam heeft, dan zal het koninkrijk lijden. Do you understand now why I tell you when you go out and people are talking bad about your pastor, you should not join them. And they know the devil is using them. They know what they are doing. And Amen. amen. Uh, I want to hear amen now. Amen. Amen. Because when you finish the gossip. En als je dan klaar bent met het roddelen. The way you see your pastor will be different. De manier hoe je dan naar je pastor zal kijken zal heel anders zijn. And if he's praying, he won't bless you. En als hij dan in gebed is, dan zal het jou niet zegenen. Because that devil mouth of that person, the, the devil gave him mouth. He has already changed how you see things and you can never. He was not after the pastor, he was after you. Want die amen. Amen. Oh, you're not saying amen anymore. Pastor, you thought was it was after jou. the pastor. It's after you. But it is not. He was not after the pastor, but he was after you. Anne. Before you left home, you loved your husband so much that even if death came to kill him, you would say, "Let me die first." That's before you left home. Voordat je dan van huis vertrok, dan had je dan uh, als het leven uh, jouw man zou ontnemen, had je gezegd van ik geef, ik geef mijn leven voor hem. So that he will be alive. Ik geef mijn leven voor hem. That has been your thought. Dat was jouw gedachte. Until you got a telephone call. Totdat je dan een telefoontje kreeg. And the person told you you know your husband 25 years ago. En die persoon die zei van oh weet je dan 25 jaar terug. He was a terror. Die was dan echt een terreur. Very wicked. Die was dan zo slecht. Very mean. En zo gemeen. And then you say, oh, but he's very quiet. Say, you don't know him. En dan zeg je van, ja, maar hij is dan zo. He has always been like that. Ja, die is. Until he will strike. Oh, tot op het moment dat hij dan zo. He said, don't you see the way he laughs? Zie je dan niet. It's not real laugh. Look at his face. He's not laughing really. Je moet beter kijken. Het is een geen echte lach. Then after that conversation. En na dat gesprek. You came home. Dan kom je thuis. When you say honey, you say ah. Huh? Is he about to strike? Now he's using honey. En dan zeg je van oh, die staat op het punt om toe te slaan. Oh, he say let's go do shopping schatje. tomorrow. Say ah where? He say let's go to Belgium. You say ah, this man wants to sell me in Belgium. <laughs> he wants to strike now. Before then there was nothing wrong. Now everything is what? Wrong. Niks, maar nu is alles verkeerd. Because somebody did not protect the image of the king. Want iemand heeft dan het imago van de koning niet beschermd. In a kingdom, the image of the king is what makes the kingdom, not the citizens. The image of the king. In het koninkrijk, het imago van de koning maakt het koninkrijk. The devil knows. En dat weet de duivel. That's why he goes after. The kings. En daarom gaat hij dan achter de koning. Most of the things you read on the you read on the newspaper about churches, they don't talk about members. Do they talk about members? Vele dingen Come on, talk to me. Do they talk about members? No, pastor. Nee, dat gaat over de pastors. Pastor did this. Pastor, pastor did, did that. Did pastor, pastor did that. Pastor. pastor. Because they know if they can put the pastor down, the sheep will scatter. Want ze weten als ze dan één pastor kunnen neerhalen, dan zullen alle schapen uit elkaar gedreven worden. Have people around you who can protect your image. Yeah, you must people around you who can protect your image. Not people who destroy it. 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 God will not say, "Oh, you want to be real." No, God will not say that. God will not say, "Oh, you want to be real." God will come after you. God, God will come after you. Because God will protect His kingdom. Because God will protect His kingdom. 
Number two. Number twee. Give, give proper what? Information. Give what? Give ze proper geven, what? Ze geven goede informatie. Give proper what? Ze geven goede informatie. Have people around you who will give proper information. Heb mensen om je heen die dan de goede informatie zullen geven. The right information. Die dan de juiste informatie Not geven. Not just anything. Niet zomaar iets. Somebody comes to you. I saw this sister in your church. She looks uh, really quiet and easy and... Uh, My brother is looking for a wife. What do you think? You say which one? Even your question alone is enough. Alleen die vraag, which one? Die in our vraag. church? Je zegt maar één ons. Oh, those ladies. Oh, die vrouw. They don't greet. Ze groeten niet. He has not even told you who. You already Ze, ja, die heeft spoiled die all the image of all the sisters. Al, alle imago van alle zusters heb je al vernietigd. Then finally say, oh yeah, some of them are also good. Oh, which one are you looking for? Zijn, welke, welke bedoel je? No, you destroyed it already. Je hebt het al vernietigd. Give proper information. Je moet de juiste informatie geven. Why don't you rejoice? Waarom verheug je je niet? And say God is about to bless you, young man. En dan zeg je van, oh de Heer die wil jou zegenen, jonge Heer. Because those are blessed people. Want die zijn dan gezegende vrouwen. God wants to use you as a channel for blessing for somebody. Why do you block it? God die wil jou gebruiken om dan een kanaal te zijn om iemand anders te zegenen. Waarom blokkeer je dat? Lift up your hands and say, Father. Father. Make me a vessel. Make me a vessel for blessing for somebody else. Oh Lord, let my life bring joy to people. Number three. Number three. Guide being a traitor. Guide against being a traitor. You must guide being a traitor. You know a traitor? A traitor is somebody who betrays somebody. Je moet dan een uh, is is a kingdom language. Traitor. Traitors are those who go behind to stab the king. Je moet dan, uh, je moet dan waakzaam zijn voor verraders. Don't let traitors be around you. Um, sta niet toe dat verraders om je heen zijn. Pray hard to know them. Je moet hard bidden om ze te kunnen herkennen. Because if they get vital information, they can destroy you. Want als ze vitale informatie van jou hebben, dan kunnen ze jou vernietigen. Remember? Herinner je? Your God's plan for your life. God's plan voor jouw leven. Is bigger than your past. Is groter als je verleden. That's why you need to take the right steps now. En daarom moet je nu de juiste stappen nemen. And I'm telling you some of the things you need to do. En ik zeg nu tegen jou wat de dingen zijn die je nu moet doen. Don't have traitors around you. Heb dan geen verraders om je heen. If you notice it. Als je dat ziet. Remove that person from your inner circle. Dan moet je dan die persoon uit je binnenste cirkel verwijderen. Can I say something to you? Kan ik dan iets tegen jou zeggen? There is geen oud praten. Er bestaat geen... Uh, I use the Dutch language because I want everybody to understand. There is nothing like let's talk it over. No, there's. Er if you dictate a traitor, als je dan een verrader ontdekt, remove that is, person from your team. Dan moet je dan die persoon uit Because a verwijder. traitor is always a traitor. Want een verrader is yeah. altijd een verrader. In the kingdom, they cut their head. In het koninkrijk dan worden ze onthoofd. You cannot say, oh yeah, don't worry, we change. No, traitors never change. They become be better in, in becoming a bigger traitor. Ze alleen maar Amen? Beter. Do you want to go far? Wil je dan ver in het leven These gaan? are some of the hard decisions you need to make. En dit zijn dan een van die die je moet nemen. Stand strongly behind the king. Sta sterk achter de koning. Stand what? What would you do? Stand strongly behind the king. Sta sterk achter de koning. If you cannot stand behind your pastor, then you have nothing in the leadership team. You quit. Als Very simple. Niet achter de If you bestaan, cannot dan stand dan behind, niet. I'm saying it before everybody. It's supposed to be leadership training, but <laughs> if you cannot stand behind your husband, then who? What are you? Als a knife or a wife? Jou, <laughs> achter, Amen. Achter jouw man kan Come on, now, let's talk. A mess of a vrouw. If you cannot stand behind your husband, are you a wife <laughs> or a knife? <laughs> Which one are you? Wat, welke ben je dan als je niet achter je man kunt staan? And if you cannot stand behind your wife. En als je niet achter je vrouw kunt staan. What should we call you? Wat moeten we jou dan noemen? You have to stand. Je moet leren staan. And it must be seen that you stand. En het moet zichtbaar zijn dat je daar staat. 
if you are having some people and there is, let me tell you, when there is controversy, that's when you know those standing with you. Okay. I've gone through it several times in our okay. ministry. Okay. That's when you, anybody in your team that says, I don't know, is not qualified to be in that team. When, when, when you know. Hey, do you hear what I'm telling you now? I'm teaching you strong things. I have gone through some hard times in sometimes in this church, and I talk to my leaders. They don't know I'm trying them. I say, what do you think about this matter? Oh my God. See, I stand behind you. They don't want to know what happens. Say, I stand behind you. Anyone that says, this matter is very tricky. I don't know. I don't know. You don't know? You're out. Because how can you not trust what I'm judging? Waarom kun je niet vertrouwen datgene wat ik dan om veroordeel? Zeg dat weet ik niet. Je weet niet. You don't know. Oh, you don't trust him. You trust the prayer and the miracles, but that one you don't trust. Je vertrouwt dan. No, you don't trust that one, right? En dat vertrouw je. Mm, is dicey because your heart is not there. Want je hart is niet daar. It's about kingdom, not about people. Het gaat om het koninkrijk. Het gaat niet om mensen. Amen. 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 Hallelujah. I think some of you are going to review your relationship when you live here. Because I'm giving you some facts. I gave you an antal feiten. Something that will help you. It's that the also help. Stand strongly behind the king. It should be. It should be clear but that you are standing behind the king. That you are after the king. Stand. Be kingdom minded. We is koning krijgt gezind. Kingdom what? Minded. Kingdom minded. what? Minded. The progress of the kingdom should be first before any other thing. Het, de vooruitgang van het koninkrijk moet op de eerste plaats staan. The progress of the church is number one. De vooruitgang van de kerk staat op nummer één. Oké, okay, let me give you an example. Ik There were some people who were here before with us and they complained of certain things. Oh, this and that and that. And because of them, you wanted to change everything. Correct, some of you. And you thought oh, they, they had a very good idea. And you thought that they had a very good idea. Where are those people now? Where are the people today? They are gone. They are gone. They didn't plan to stay. Ze waren niet van plan om te no blijven. matter what you change, they won't stay. So the kingdom is more important than the individual. Dus het koninkrijk is altijd belangrijker als de individuen. So be kingdom minded. Dus wees koninkrijks, koninkrijksgezind. What is best? What is het beste? For the kingdom. For the kingdom. What is best for your family? What is it best for your family? What is best for your relationship? What is it best for your relationship? Not what is best for your girlfriend. She will Niet leave you and go. Best for your friend. Die zal dan toch wel gaan. Not what is best for your family friend. Your family friend will go one day. Or for the friend of your family. Die zal dan op een dag gaan. I'm bringing and breaking it down. Somebody say break it down. Break it down. The next one is mindset. Je gedachten gaan. Your thoughts. Your gedachte. You must change your thoughts. Je moet je gedachte veranderen. Change your thoughts. Je gedachte veranderen. See God as a loving God. De uh, God zien als een liefdevolle God. That God that is ready to bless you. De uh, God die dan klaar is om jou te zegen. See your king as a blesser. Zie jouw koning als de zegen. Uh, See your zegen. pastor as somebody who is sent by God to bless you. Zie jouw pastor als degene die door God gezonden is om jou te zegenen. Then the blessing will begin to come. En dan zal de zegeningen komen. See him as your man of God. Zie hem als jouw man van God. See your children as a blessing from God. See your children as a blessing from God. And thank God that they are blessed. And thank God that they are so blessed. And you are blessed also. And that you are so blessed. And thank God for them. And thank God for them. And they will transform to the words that are coming out of your mouth. And they will be transformed by the words that are coming out of your mouth. I told you before, if you say your wife is wicked, she will be wicked. If you say she is sweet, she will be sweet. Ik heb je al reeds gezegd. Amen. Als je zegt, mijn vrouw is slecht. Do you know why? God said Adam should name everything in the world. Anything he call it, that is what it will be. Is that in the Bible? Alles wat je een naam geeft. Is it in the Bible? So we are called to give things name. Dus we moeten dingen dan een naam geven. Amen. So when you call the person wicked, the person will be very mean. Because it's the name you gave. Amen. But when you say sweet, even when you call the person sweet, the person doesn't reply. Don't worry. Keep on calling the person sweet. The person wants to get adjusted to that name because from a very, you know, the person has very low self-esteem. So you say, "Am I sweet? I thought I'm bitter. No, you are sweet. Just respond, okay? 
Amen. 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 I'm happy many people right now. Ik help een aantal mensen. If the man managed to say sweet, they respond. Als die man het uh, zo ver krijgt. He has never said it for 40 years. Now he said it finally. Shout hallelujah. Yeah. Juich hallelujah. Your child has been calling your name for years. Suddenly he call you mommy. Then you just say praise the Lord. <laughs> Keep okay. calling it. I like it. Amen. Amen. Your mindset is very important. Het gaat om jouw gedachten. I'll just give you one. Then discipline. Discipline. We'll continue next time. Discipline is very, very important. Discipline is ook heel belangrijk. There must be discipline in the kingdom. Er moet ook discipline zijn in het koninkrijk. A king wants disciplined people around him. Een koning die wil gedisciplineerde mensen om zich heen. He doesn't want indisciplined people around him. Die wil geen ongedisciplineerde mensen. People who are not disciplined, they always have excuses. Mensen die dan geen discipline hebben, hebben altijd excuses. Always excuse. Altijd een excuus. And the last one is humility. En de laatste, dat is nederigheid. Humility. Nederigheid. People around the king should be humble. Mensen om de koning heen moeten nederig zijn. They should be humble. Ze moeten nederig zijn. They must be humble. Er moet nederigheid zijn. You cannot have people who are not humble around you. Je kan geen mensen om je heen hebben die niet nederig zijn. Otherwise they will chase everybody away from the kingdom. Anders zullen ze dan iedereen wegdrijven van het Now let's go to Philippians chapter 4 verse 8. Laten we dan nu gaan naar Filippenzen 4 vers 8. And then we we'll pray with that. En dan zullen we dan daarmee bidden. Amen. 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 Touch your neighbor and say, I am kingdom minded. Zeg dan tegen jou naaste, ik ben koninkrijksgezind. Touch your neighbor and say, from now on. Zeg tegen jou naaste vanaf nu. My eyes will be open. Mijn ogen zullen geopend zijn. And I will serve the king. En ik zal dan de koning dienen. From my heart. Vanuit mijn hart. I give my heart. Ik geef mijn hart. To the king of kings. To the koning der koningen. I will not betray. Ik zal dan niet van verraden zijn. Myself. Tot mezelf. Oh God. Or my church, my church, or my family, my family. I will always work orderly. In order, work. Philippians chapter four, verse eight. Finally, brethren, whatsoever things are true, whatsoever things are honest, whatsoever things are just, whatsoever things are pure. Whatsoever things are lovely, whatsoever things are of good report, if there be any virtue, and if there be any praise, think on these things. Think on these things and you will never suffer in life. Denk, um, uh, denk over deze dingen en je zal nooit in het leven lijden. You want to go forward? Wil je vooruit gaan in het leven? There is a way to get there. Er is een weg om daar te komen. And if you take another road, you will not get there. En als je een andere weg neemt, dan zul je daar nooit belanden. If there is anything you have learned today, als er iets is wat je vandaag geleerd hebt, you should know that God's plan is bigger than your past. Dan moet je dan weten dat Gods plan groter is dan je verleden. And the number two, you must know. En nummer twee, dan moet je weten that the people around you dat de mensen om je heen determines what happens around you. bepalen wat om je heen gebeurt. You should also know en je moet ook weten dat de performance van een koning de op het optreden van de koning depends on the the dat, cabinet that he has. Dat is afhankelijk van de mensen, het kabinet om zich heen, om de koning heen. If you value your life als je dan je leven waardeert and you value your future, en je waardeert je toekomst, you make some hard decisions. Dan moet je dan een aantal harde beslissingen nemen. Don't allow people to pull you down. Sta niet toe dat mensen jou neerhalen. Hold on to people who pull you up. Ha, hou je vast aan mensen die jou dan uh, helpen om opwaarts te gaan. Because one day they will abandon you. Want op één dag zullen die mensen jou achter. You are not the first person they met. Het is jij bent dan niet de eerste die ze ontmoeten. They have met many people before. Ze hebben vele mensen ontmoet. So they, they were not born yesterday. Dus ze zijn niet gisteren geboren. So because you met them does not mean you've met somebody that has never met other people before. Ask them where are your old friends? Where are all of them? Vraag dan van hey waar zijn dan jouw oude vrienden? They will tell you those people they are very bad. And also you. So everybody has been bad until you met me. Allemaal slecht. Lift up your hands and say, Father, we thank you for what you have done. Blessed be your name. My life will never be the same again. I am blessed 
To be a blessing. That is who you are. In Jesus name.